Welcome back to another episode, guys. Starting this one out with surprise, another new car. Well, uh, not just yet. The deal's not quite done, but uh, my mate's got the surf at the moment, checking it over at his work. So he's gonna come back to me. Oh, yeah, he dropped this off yesterday. Pick the surf up. It's pretty, uh, pretty cool looking. Pretty fancy. Crown on BCs. Pretty buzzy colour too. It's like a 60th anniversary one or something. Saitama. Imported. So, yeah, it's pretty fucking fancy. Um, yeah, 2007 Crown Athlete. I don't know if it's still an athlete because uh, of the uh, 3.5 litre V6, but yeah, it's pretty fucking fancy dog. Oh. You gotta fucking put on the brake. Adjust all that steering wheel and stuff because well, that's why I want to figure out if it had a reversing camera. Ah, it does. Cool. Super cool. But yeah, I'm stoked with it if I end up getting it out in the steering wheel. Nice. But yeah, no. Pretty stoked. TV in there. I don't know what that is. Maybe it's just a seat. I was hoping there'd be a fridge. Outside, I can fucking baby Yoda. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, pretty bloody cool, all right. <laughs> oh yeah, this might be this. Is there a fridge in here? Ah, uh, no, no fucking fridge. Ratchet. Oh well. <laughs> Cup holders for those. Oh yeah. yeah, pretty sick. Not much to show you under the hood, just some plastic and shit. But uh, yeah, waiting for a uh, waiting for old Gigi Angie to come pick me up now, and we're gonna go rip into another episode of the C5. Got a new motor for his Lafero, so we're gonna get into that. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. Should be some good content, banter with the boys. Peace, see you soon. What's up, team? Here we are, today's the day, getting the Sephiro done, can't really see it, but yeah, this is my 20D Sephiro, <coughs> GG Angie in the house, yeah, we put it right out the block, so we've got to change the engine, um, so yeah, it's a 20D, we're going to put a Series 0, 25D into it, um, and then, yeah, Today's the day we're just going to pull the engine out. Get a few other wee things done. Take the tour of the chaser. Sure. We've got Gigi Zach here. Mention Maybe. merch. Mention merch. Yeah. So this is the engine. 20D. I got um, Tomo camshafts. Timing gears. I got those. Extractors there, high rise ones made for it. Rapid done all the work, got it all churned in that, made 176 horsepower, and then, um, yeah, had the lumpy idle, raised the rev limit, it only lasted like just under 3,000 k's. And then, I can't really see, but if I can put it right out the block, so yeah, time to replace the engine. Not a bad Ceph. Got the cool rear centre garnish. Everyone goes crazy for. 
Just installed these roof racks on it the other day. $60 ones. Just clip into the gutters there. Bit of a rubber thing there to protect the roof. Got the monsoons all around. Everyone goes crazy for those. The C33 front. It's got juddies. Some fucking small 15s. We're just about to take the bonnet off. Make it easier to access everything. Disconnect everything, drain the fluids, and take the exhaust manifold off. And we're away laughing. Probably cue the time lapse. Car in the sense of uh, Martin and Angie's friendship, anyway. I bought it when I first moved to Dunedin, I think, for what, four and a half grand about six or seven years ago. Yeah. Okay. Starting friendship since, like, he got a, got the Maroon Safari that I eventually would end up getting, and he wanted this back, so we done a deal and <laughs> swapped back. But and my when I owned this, I drove up and down the island, like took it up to Road. Had nothing but trouble-free motoring, and then uh. Swapped it back to Angie and then he went and took it to Rapid and made it fucking fully sick pumped. One night on the piss, a few too many beers. See ya, man. Fucking holding it on limiter till it kicked the leg out of bed, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> Solid effort, mate. And ready to come out. Got the uh, everything disconnected, exhaust off, bow housing bolts out. Now we're at the point where we um, test the tensile strength of everything still attached. So I'm looking more on this side, whatever loom I haven't connected or gets caught up in the way. We shall find out. Stay tuned.
it down. She will come down and put all the fucking mana into it. Now it's time to go pick up the 25, I suppose. Like a glove. Gonna have to do the fucking cam bout straight away. Yeah, no, somebody had a good go with the fucking power washer, eh? So you just go keep it like that? Yeah, that's mad. Fuck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, there's a bit of grease in there. Get out of the way, Shu. Sure. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, fucking mint. Got it in. Just thought I'd video the. Oh, yeah. Oh, brother. Tidying the bay up. Whoa. Yeah, no, nah, we're going. Oh, we're going good. We're on track to fucking getting it in today. Don't know if we'll get it running, but uh. Fuck all the boys on there, many hands make for the light work, eh? Mm -hmm. Except oh, for this fucking yeah, clean car. Yeah, yeah fucking yeah, now. <laughs> At least he took some random right in his car that pulled up. Bought us a free box, so. Yeah. Can't go wrong with the double browns, eh? Oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, advertisement. <laughs> yeah, buddy. We're out here. Still, oh, many hands make a lot of work. <laughs> we'll, uh, get it in. Breathers, fuck, that was one of the most seamless things. Yeah, we just, yeah, we just in and out smoke, bro. Oh, fuck, I know. So, boys. In the hut. Oh, we put the 20 back in. You should be the truck. Probably a uh, good time and too, because the camera's going to go flat. Is it stop sitting now, though? So, yeah, I think to uh, push it back, put it on the hoist, then uh, probably call it a day. But I know I'm filthy, I'm getting a bit hungry. We'll uh, come back tomorrow. Yeah, fuck me, no, dear boys. Hard. Done it. Good.